In this tutorial, we'll learn how to set a manual exposure on a Canon T8i. When setting a manual exposure, we'll need to control three things, our ISO, our aperture, and our shutter speed. The T8i has a built-in light meter, which we'll use to help us set our settings. You can view it on the rear of the camera, on the display panel, or when you look through the viewfinder, you'll see it as a LED on the bottom of the frame. I always start by setting my ISO because this is the setting that is the least likely to change. In this example, our subject will be in bright sunlight, so we'll be using a low ISO of 200. On the T8i, you can set the ISO in one of two ways. You can push the ISO button on the top of the camera, or you can use the quick command button on the rear of the camera and then touch the screen to select ISO. When the ISO dialog opens, you can use the quick control dial to scroll to the left to set the ISO to 200, then press the set button to select that. Next we want to set our aperture, or our f-stop. To change the aperture on a T8i, use the quick control dial on the rear by rotating it left or right to adjust your f-stop. If I rotate the dial to the left, I'm going to decrease my f-stop. If I move it, rotate it to the right, I'm going to increase my f-stop. In this example, we'll set our f-stop to 5.6. Now that we've set our ISO and our aperture, the last thing is to set our shutter speed. To determine what to set our shutter speed to, we're going to take a light reading with the camera's onboard light meter. We're going to point the camera at the subject and depress the shutter release button halfway down to activate the light meter. If I'm looking at the display on the rear of the camera, when I depress the shutter release button halfway, I'll see the square pop up on the light meter. Right now, at 200th of a second, the light meter is showing me that it's letting in almost two stops too much light. You can see the little square kind of jumping between the two and three. I'm going to turn the main dial on the top of the camera to adjust the shutter speed. As I turn it to the right, I'll begin increasing the shutter speed and I'll be moving that little square down until it gets to the center point. This would be a proper exposure. So this is one one thousandth of a second at five six at ISO 200. And that's how we use the light meter on a T8i to set a manual exposure.